Hello, welcome back. Today I am here with another video for you. I am going to show you the way Bajans season their meat before cooking. It is made with a variety of different herbs and I will be making some for you today. Now when I was growing up a little girl, this is something that my grandmother and all the elders made um, to season the meat, especially if there's something in barbecue called flying fish to season the fish and the meat, whatever you want to cook, it is always good to be able to season it with that. But today's technology is different because back then, my grandmother would stand there on the chopping board and sometimes we used to have to help her too. You got the onions just kind of, you're crying from the onions burning on your eyes. But my grandmother would cut up her seasoning and then she had a bottle and she would just roll the bottle like a Coke bottle and she would roll it on the seasoning to, to mash it down to get it just right to put it in her bottle and you put that in the bottle and it would last for a very long time. Today we're not going that route. I'm not going to be cutting it up and so to save time with new technology I have a food processor. So I'm going to put everything in here and grind it up and then you'll see exactly how I do it. Now once I get this seasoning all together, what I'm going to do is put it in a bottle. And in, once I put it in a bottle, it can stay in the refrigerator for months. And whenever you're going to cook, you're going to do some chicken or lamb or fish or whatever you're going to do, all you have to do is take some of it out and season up that meat with it. So today I have some chicken that today's Saturday so I'm gonna season up my chicken for Sunday so I'm gonna show you exactly how I'm gonna do that so let's start by grinding up our herbs so the first thing I'm gonna do I want to show you what I have here I have some mint and these are some stuff that I grow in my garden I have some fresh mint here this is fresh thyme I have some oregano. This I happen to have in a garden, some oregano. I have like two of these, two pods of garlic. I'm going to be using two full pods of garlic. I have one full pepper. I have one onion and I have like four packs of scallions. So I'm going to grind this all up and then let you see. So let's store it. See, we've come a long way because otherwise we'd be chopping. My daughter used to, was a swimmer. So whenever I send her to chopping an onion, she used to go get her goggles. I put her goggles on and I don't have goggles. <laughs> so I'm going to start with my scallions by just putting some in here. We're making Bajan seasoning, guys. Bajan seasoning. This is the way the Bajans make the seasonings. Let me get this thing on here. Oops. There we go. Good on there. My grandmother would have loved this years ago when she used to make seasoning. She would have loved this. This would have saved her a lot of time. It's okay, Brian. Let me just break this and push it down there. Okay. So this is the first set here of the onions. Actually, this is the scallions that I just chopped up. I still have a few more to put in because I can put in too much at once. So I just chopped that up. So now I'm going to put in another set. Put my blade in. But I'm going to just chop this up and then come back to you because I don't want the noise to be too loud in your ears. So. I'm going to chop this up and then I'm going to come back to you. I just chopped up some more scallions so now I'm going to drop my onions in there. Guys, make your own 
get your own herbs together to season your meat make it taste yummy yummy then we my onions and my scallions are finished so I'm just going to add everything in here stem and all so there goes my oregano and guys I grow that in my garden my garden looks good and this is a little bit of mint and we have a pepper some people put more than one pepper but if you like spicy you put more pepper I like spicy but I added more spice if I need more spice and I have my thyme here I don't have any parsley otherwise I would put some parsley and I have all this as I told you two pods of garlic I love garlic garlic is very good for you so I use a lot of garlic and I just put everything in there and whoops I should have put this in first. <laughs> now I gotta start over. So there goes my pepper, my oregano, my mint. I grow that mint in the garden. That mint smells so good. My thyme and all that, all this nice garlic in there. Yep. Put my cover on. And I'm not going to pulse this in your ears. I'll show you after because I know it gets very loud. All our herbs are finished. But I'm going to transfer this to this bigger bowl. Because it's a bit. this bowl is a bit too small. So I have to transfer this over here. And in here, I'm going to add my other stuff to here. All the good herbs. So this is with the pepper and the thyme and the oregano. Now I gotta get somebody to take this out because I can't just wash this down. This is good herbs. You need all that good stuff. You can't get rid of that. See, that's a whole a good set right there. Yep. Let me just put this over here. And then now we're going to mix this really well. Mix this really well, guys. And now I'm going to add all my seasonings to this. So first, I'm going to start with some salt. And you're going to add a good set of salt to that. Oops, salt is almost empty. Look at that. Gotta buy some more salt. And here I have some more garlic powder. You just add some garlic powder to that. Yep. And I have here some paprika. Open the bigger hole. Add some paprika. I'm going to add some Old Bay seasoning to that. I will add some black pepper. I need a bigger hole for this black pepper. There we go. Some black pepper. I'm going to add... Oh my goodness, that dog is running back and forth. I'm going to add some clove. A little clove to that and this is um, crushed pepper I'm gonna add a little bit to that so I just add all those herbs to that so now not herbs seasonings to the herbs so now ooh, <laughs> good catch I'm gonna put some lime juice and just rinse this real quick
I'm gonna squeeze some lemon juice to that. And just mix it up, guys. Mix. That's basically it. I'm gonna put a little more of this lime juice in here. Mix up. So this is your Bajan seasoning here. So now I'm gonna taste it a little bit. And this is how I'm gonna taste it. I'm just gonna put my finger on it like that. Need more stuff, need something. Need some more salt, definitely. Don't need any more lime juice. Because sometimes this takes a lot of salt. And that's the end of that salt bottle too, because that's empty, no more. Mix that up some more. I don't even taste the pepper in it. I do not even taste the pepper. Oh, all purpose seasoning. I forgot my all purpose seasoning. All purpose seasoning. Now let me mix that up some more. It's good. Let me try it again. Better. Tastes better. I have some parsley flakes. So well, I'm gonna put some parsley flakes in here. It would have been better for fresh parsley, but I forgot the fresh parsley when I went to the store. So I'm gonna put a little parsley flakes in there. Yeah. Parsley flakes. And I am going to put a, some more because it, it still needs to be a little more seasoned to me. I'm going to put a little more Obey, Obey in there. I'm going to put a little more black pepper. A little more garlic powder. There's garlic powder. And a little bit more of this all purpose seasoning. That should be good. And it has a whole lime juice lime in here. I don't need any more lime. That is good. Mix it up. And Barbados they also add something called marjoram. But I don't think I've never seen that here, so I don't know where you get that from. That's another herb called marjoram. I'm gonna show you how to season up your meat with this. I have a chicken. And I'm going to season up this chicken and show you exactly how to season up your chicken. But I need to taste it again to make sure that it tastes okay before I put it in the bottle. See if I need to add anything else to it. Nope. It tastes just the way we want it to taste. It tastes good. All those seasonings. So guys look here this is your Barbados seasoning so let me show you what I'm gonna do next I have a bottle this was a coffee bottle that I had and I saved after it was empty I saved the bottle because I knew I wanted to make some seasoning so you get a clean bottle and then you just put your seasoning in the bottle see this has a big mouth so it's easy to take a small spoon, even a big spoon, and put in here to take out when you need some. Okay? So you don't have to pour it out. You can just take a spoon and dip it out when you're ready. So this is what this bottle is for. And this is good to season fish, guys. If you have fish, you put this in your fish. Put your fish to marinate for a little bit. Mmm, it's good. And this, as I said, will last for months. See that? And I have some that is left back in this bowl right here. And this is what I'm gonna season up my chicken with. So I'm gonna get, um, let me show you my chicken right now. 
and this is my chicken guys I have my chicken here in um, lemon vinegar and I am gonna wash this off and I'm gonna season it up okay guys so here is our Bajan seasoning I have one here Tina Rain Bajan seasoning so I will keep this in my refrigerator and I will use it whenever I need it now I left some of the seasoning back in this bowl the one that I just grind up and over here I have a chicken this is a whole chicken that I cut in half it's already cleaned so now I am going to season it to show you how we season our meat so I take all this good stuff and all I do is I'm gonna rub it all around all here inside the cavities of the chicken I'm just gonna rub that good stuff then I'm gonna turn it over and we have the skin here just pull your skin apart I just take this stuff and just stick it inside all inside yep on the other side we do the same thing stick it all inside to make sure everything every part of the chicken gets covered okay so we come back here go under the skin stick some more under the skin here we go all under the skin and then Stick it in, in there. Let's go to the neck part. Hey, chicky, chicky, chick. Stick it in there, all inside. And now once you've stuck it all inside, now what you're gonna do is ladder all the outside, the legs. Let's go under the arm here. This wing, all underneath. Put it back here and if you want to do this too you can do this you can this piece of um, chicken breast right here you can cut you can cut down inside of that chicken breast right there because you want your meat to, your, your seasoning to penetrate inside of it and here's your other breast just cut down on the inside and then just take the seasoning and just stick it in there. Just stick some more and just stick it in there. Inside you go. In there. And just make sure you take all of it out of your bowl. And make sure it goes all inside the leg part. All of it got some yeah and then what I'm gonna do is I will put some foil paper on this I'm gonna put some foil paper on this now stick this in the refrigerator and this will be my dinner for tomorrow this would stay there and it will marinate until I'm ready to put it in the oven okay so now we got our foil paper and we just wrap this up nice and tight And this will sit in the refrigerator until sometime tomorrow when they decide to cook. So guys, that's how we make our Bajan seasoning. I hope you can try this and, and season your food. A little pepper and salt is not enough. You need a little more than pepper and salt. You need some good herbs in your food to be able to eat fresh herbs. So try making some seasoning and keep it in the refrigerator. You can keep it for as long as you want. You make a big sack and it'll stay in there for a little while. And season your meat, your fish, whatever you want to do, marinate it and then put it in the refrigerator. And then when you're ready, you just go cook, fry, whatever you want to do. Thank you so much for joining me. I had so much fun making this. I hope you have fun making some for your family. Until next time, don't forget to subscribe and to give me a thumbs up if you like the video. Bye bye now.